who's in a little bit of silence. 1-1. One, one. A hot shot. Pass short. Grab Mike. Kind of full up and throws to first in time. He stole a hit away from Correa. Connor Falefa got rid of it quickly. That's been part of his thing, too, is makes the tie on as the Twins go down in order, and the Yankees come to bat. Chris Archer, you know, started off hot this season, but went on the IL for two weeks in July. And since coming back, he's pitching to a 7.08 ERA, so scuffed in five innings. One guy who's been extremely consistent in this lineup throughout the year. And Judge is at second with a double. And right on time, big 99 continues. One-time twin, Josh Donaldson. That one is driven to left field and deep. Going back, kick on Correa. Swing and a miss, got him. So Correa strands the runner at second. One down. That'll bring up Marwin Gonzalez. He's hitless his last 29 at bats. In fact, the last base hit he got was against a position. Said it, Chris Archer, it doesn't matter what count, what situation. When he needs a pitch, when he needs a strike, he's going to go to that slot. Walk to Donaldson, and that'll bring up Trevino. Fielded by Correa. He'll double play turn by the Twins. Pretty routine right there. Second walk given up by Tyone. And that's a much better hitter when he hits to right and right center. Judge will come up with a runner on first. Drill deep to left field. There it goes. See ya. A long home run into the second deck. Number 54. And the Yankees lead 4-2. to two. And mama, there goes that man here, Aaron Judge. Boy, a foul ball by Santa, and he almost fell over. That's how off balance he is. You know, you watch him right there, and you just wonder how healthy he is because on a few of these, you can see it with that finish. We'll see if he stays in the game, but that was a very awkward.